uh, Ryan is in a world of hurt right now, Smokey, removing that turnbuckle pad from that other turnbuckle. And I'm telling you, fans, that's not going to look good on either one of these guys. I got a feeling Smokey is looking to try and crash Ryan's face right into that turnbuckle. And see, fans, this is not only is an Intercontinental title match, but I mean, this is basically a hit put on Ryan by H.A. Duke, and Smokey has answered the call here tonight. And H.A. Duke doing everything he can to help Smokey secure a championship victory and get Ryan's ass kicked basically in the same match. And right now we see Ryan. He's trying to fight back. Smokey with a reversal now. He's got him in a hammerlock. Shows Ryan away. Rushes in, and Ryan catches him with a drop toe. And Smokey face first into the mat. Both men back on the feet. Smokey with a spinning toe kick. Or whatever you call it. Spinning heel kick, whatever you call it. Smokey and Ryan with a collar and elbow tie up here. Smokey's got Ryan set up here. Huge backbreaker right across the knee of the Intercontinental Champion. I'll tell you, fans, this has been a crazy matchup. Smokey trying to win the Intercontinental Championship. They're locked inside this steel cage. Now Ryan trying to mount some offense. So far, it's been all Smokey. And there's another running knee lift. Ryan goes down. Ryan looks like to be knocked out here. Smokey off the top. Flying leg drop catches Ryan right across the throat here. And I'll tell you, fans, for a moment there, it looked like Ryan may have been knocked out. Now look at this, Smokey. Smokey slamming Ryan's head repeatedly into that exposed steel turnbuckle. No protection, no cover on that turnbuckle right now. That is pure steel, fans. Smokey repeatedly, over and over, slamming Ryan's face into that turnbuckle. Finally lets him go. There's a kick to the gut now, followed by a knife edge, chopped by Smokey. There's a second. Ryan blocks, Smokey blocks, Smokey back in charge. And there's a drop kick right to the throat of the Intercontinental Champion. You now Ryan trying to fight back here. Smokey went for another kick. Ryan caught him and leg sweep takes Smokey down. Smokey fighting back with another punch to the gut here. Went for another spinning heel kick and Ryan moved out of the way. Now Ryan trying to get offense going here. Both of these guys attacking at the same time here. And Ryan getting backed up here. And he catches Smokey again. There's another... Oh, man, driving those freaking knees right into the face of Smokey once again. Now, Ryan, look at that. Ryan actually was going to try to climb out of the cage. Smokey not having anything of it. Smokey up top. Ryan just kind of in a daze here. Smokey with a cross splash off the top rope. Catches Ryan. Intercontinental Champion is reeling here now. Smokey going back up top again. What could he be doing here? Looks like, oh, man, a big old huge frog splash delivered by Smokey. That was not the acid flash that Smokey uses to put his opponents away. I guess Smokey giving Ryan the benefit of the doubt here. Look at that, Smokey now signaling that the end is coming. It is almost time to end this match. And here we go. It could be it. Smokey's got Ryan up. Here we go. Spins him around. SKO delivered to the Intercontinental Champion. And now Smokey. Smokey going up the ropes here. Could this be it? He's cocking it up. It's going to be the acid splash. And we're all yelling. Here's the cover. Are we going to have a new Intercontinental Champion? One, two... No! Ryan just barely rolls up the shoulder. Oh my god, fans, how close was that? And Smokey right back to the attack here. Oh my god, that was unbelievable, fans. That could not have been any closer. Now Smokey stomping away on Ryan. Catches Ryan with another spinning heel kick. Smokey going up top here. Coming off with another frog splash on to Ryan. Ryan definitely out of his element here. Smokey feeling it from the fans. Oh my god, Smokey getting fired up here. Ryan turns around. And Smokey now, Smokey's got Ryan, tosses him over his head. There's another knife edge chop. Smokey in total control of the matchup right now. Ryan catches Smokey unaware though with a hip toss. And Smokey right back up to his feet, catches Ryan with a running bulldog. Smokey lifts Ryan back up here. Oh my god, here we go. Oh my god, there's the acid miss to the face. And now Smokey pointing to the fans. Pointing to the fans. Here we go. He spins. Spins and red drops him. Head first onto the mat. Oh, my God, fans. Unbelievable. Here's the cover. This could do it, fans. This could do it. That's it. Oh, my God. Smokey dominated Ryan in this matchup. Fans, we have a new HCW Intercontinental Champion. Oh, my God, fans. I am so sorry. I'm about to lose my voice here. Oh my god, this has been unbelievable. Oh my god, so many titles have changed hands here tonight. Oh my god, there you have it, fans. Smokey is now a three-time champion here in HCW. He is the new Intercontinental Champion.
fans, here we go. It is now time for the main event of Crashdown. And I'll tell you, this is going to be an electrifying event here, fans. It's Osiris. He's the OF or the HCW World Heavyweight Champion. He's held that title ever since Halloween Massacre. And he is set to defend it tonight against Mark Hawkins and a mystery opponent that we are yet to know who it is. H.A. Duke making this a triple threat match earlier tonight. We still don't know who that third person is going to be that's going to be in this matchup. Oh, but boy. I'll tell you, fans. Look at the goal. Oh, yeah. Look at the goal. This is what it's all about. Shut the fuck up, Joe Lawler. Anyhow, back to reality here. Osiris is going to have a huge stipulation on his back here tonight. He has an opportunity to retire Mark Hawkins for good here tonight at Crashdown. And here comes Hawkins now. I tell you, he has demanded this world title shot against Osiris here tonight. H.A. Duke, finally reluctant, gives him the match, but adds this special stipulation. If Osiris pins Hawkins here tonight, Hawkins will be fired from HCW. So I'll tell you, fans, and now they're adding in a third man in this matchup. That makes things even more difficult for Hawkins. Stacks the tables even more against Hawkins. Now, fans, there are some little stipulations I need to add to the match here, or to this matchup. This third competitor, if he ends up pinning Hawkins or pinning Osiris, Hawkins keeps his job. The only way Hawkins can get fired here tonight is if Osiris pins him. So Osiris looking to successfully defend his championship yet again, but not only that, he wants to pin Mark Hawkins here tonight. He wants to get Hawkins out of HCW. And I'll tell you, if that happens, main event nation are through. We already seen what happened earlier tonight between Speck and Fletch. And I'll tell you, fans, main event nation just crumbling. Wu-Tang Man gone, has not been heard from. Paul Barber gone, not been heard from. And here we go. Oh, my God, fans. What a fitting third person to add to this mix-up here tonight. It's none other than Jason Richardson. He's going to get another shot, another opportunity at the HCW Undisputed World Heavyweight Championship here tonight at Crashdown. This could not be better here. H.A. Duke giving this young man another opportunity after what happened on Livewire. It was Jason Richardson. He won a four-man tournament to be crowned the number one contender and to have a number one uh, contendership one-on-one -on -one matchup with Osiris for the World Championship on Livewire. And none other than Mark Hawkins interfered in that match, cost Jason Richardson the possible championship. So what better way to reward Jason Richardson and to get back at Mark Hawkins than to add Richardson to this matchup here tonight. Fans, triple threat match. Jason Richardson versus Osiris versus Mark Hawkins. This is your main event for Crashdown this year. And it is for the World Heavyweight Championship. And a special stipulation still looming in the air. If Osiris pins Hawkins, Hawkins is fired from HCW. I tell you, fans, I'm really excited. All night long, all crashed down. It's all brewed down to this. There's only been one champion so far tonight who has successfully defended his title. Can Osiris successfully defend his title here tonight? Or will we see yet another title change? Fans, referee is displaying the championship, and this match is about to get underway here in just a second. 